Alright boys, Roy Holiday actually just ended up dropping and this card looks so, so good. Oh my gosh. But let's go look at Roy Holiday, his card, and how you guys are going to end up doing the fastest XP method in the game to end up getting Roy Holiday ASAP. So you can actually end up seeing his 95 overall. Comes at 200,000 XP with 106 hits per 9. Easily the best pitcher in the game right now. And I love that they made Roy Holiday a good card. I would have been mad if he was under 100 hits per nine. And it's awesome that he's just, he's joined, he's joined the team. And I'm so excited to end up getting this guy. He's going to be disgusting. Now, a couple of things that you guys are going to want to do before you do my XP glitch and the XP method I'm going to be talking about today is make sure you guys do your daily moments every day. Obviously, I haven't because I just started. But 3,000 XP, pretty good. Uh, not too bad. And then the exchanges. So if... I would not do the exchanges for live series players. The reason why I wouldn't do it is because I just don't think it's worth it. So don't do the exchanges. Maybe do the conquest. Don't do March to October. And maybe do some of these and kind of prioritize these parallel XPs if you end up having some of these cards. As far as the feature program moments, they are good. I do some of them that are easy and end up taking less time, but the XP method that I give you today is gonna to be better than a lot of these things. Just make sure that you guys don't do the exchanges because it's just not worth it. Do my XP method that we're talking about today and you guys will do just fine. Okay, in today's XP video, we're gonna be making roughly about 50 to 60,000 XP per hour. And that is no joke. You will be making upwards to 50 to 60,000 XP an hour. It is absolutely disgusting with the program XP and everything that you end up getting towards it. It is going to compile and you're gonna be able to get Roy Holiday in roughly about four hours. We're gonna say around four hours of gameplay. I should have Roy Holiday by the end of the day and I should have a debut with Roy Holiday by tomorrow. So count me to that. We're gonna be grinding that. Now, if you haven't already, make sure you guys go and hit that like and sub button. We are getting close and close to 10K subs. We are absolutely killing it right now. Hit that sub button. I know a bunch of you guys watching this video aren't subbed. So hit that like and that sub button and let's get right into how you guys are gonna make a ton of XP. And we're gonna be talking about the fastest XP method in the game. Now this method is absolutely glitchy. And what you guys are actually going to end up doing to finish this program fast is Road to the Show method. Now it is back and it is amazing. You're gonna be getting about 40 to 50,000 XP an hour and you're gonna be getting about four to 6,000 XP per game. So what you guys are gonna be doing is a couple of things. First thing you guys are gonna do is create a ball player. You're gonna create this ball player and basically what you're gonna do to this ball player is you're gonna make sure that he is a pitching archetype and for the motions and sound, this is the most important part of it. You're gonna make him absolutely disgusting and have the fastest pitching appearance so it goes really quick. So you're gonna go to motions and sounds, you're gonna go to animations and you're gonna go find Tyler Rogers. You can see I have the cheesy left-handed cap and Tyler Rogers is gonna throw out of the stretch, he's gonna throw Ched. Now it doesn't matter what pitches you have, but make sure you lock this in whenever you end up pressing create. So you make this Joe Random or whatever created player, he's gonna be your road to the show guy. And what you're gonna make sure that you guys are doing is two things. Now the big settings that matter in this XP method, number one in this XP method, is you gotta make sure that fast play is on. So you go to presentation mode, go to fast play. Now one thing I like to do whenever I'm grinding this is it's really easy, is you wanna make sure that you have mode specific fielding opportunities off, that way you don't have to deal with that. And another thing that you wanna end up doing to make it really easy is whenever you're doing this method, one thing that I usually do in Road to the Show is I make it classic. And I usually end up playing on a Hall of Fame difficulty because it's it makes the most sense for me because you get a pretty good amount of strikeouts on here and you don't really get rocked that much but whenever you do get rocked it's okay but the big thing is is that whenever I was playing on legend at least without having an absolute stud cap because he's still leveling up you're gonna want to do Hall of Fame. Hall of Fame is usually the best kind of middle ground for XP. You do get more XP on Legend, but you do get hit a little bit more. So whenever you have all of these settings, you're gonna be going into these. Make sure you apply the settings. I know I'm blocking it right now, but make sure you apply it. And you're gonna be going into these games as your pitcher, player locked, obviously. And you're gonna be sh absolutely shoving for some double A guys. Now on top of this, you're gonna be getting XP from the games and you're gonna be getting XP from the ball player program. So if you already have a maxed out ball player pitching program, start a new one. Because whenever you're starting a new one, you're not only just getting the XP in the game, but you're also getting XP through the reward path. So there's gonna be games where you end up getting upwards of nine to 10,000 XP, cause you'll end up getting 5,000 from the program for that game. Now each game takes roughly about three to five minutes. I mean, it kind of depends on just 
when you get taken out sometimes you get taken out in the fifth for literally no reason but like you can see here is i am throwing sub i'm throwing absolute chet and yes this is the most cheesy cap in the world i know if you if i want to bring him to rank seasons or any type of online play he's going to be absolutely disgusting so not only are you grinding xp with this but you're also creating a cap that's going to like win you games and often whenever i do this i just watch netflix or i grind youtube or i edit or i watch youtube videos i just kind of chill and hang out because it's honestly something that takes absolutely zero brain power so if you want something that's easy and gets you a ton of xp this is definitely the method to actually end up doing it it's definitely the best xp method in the game right now it's changed from what it was it's a lot better than my roster method that i ended up putting out a couple of weeks ago so this is the best way that you guys are going to end up getting 95 overall roy holiday all right, boys, so I ended up finishing three innings. I'm not going to finish the whole game so you guys kind of understand just about how much XP you're going to be getting per inning. So you can see at the end of this game, I ended up getting 1,800 XP. Now, that was for three innings of play, and no, there's no way it ended up taking more than two to three minutes to end up getting about 1,700 to 1,800 XP there. And so it was really, really, really simple. Now, the further you end up getting through the program, the more XP you get, obviously 1,500, 1,500. You guys should all know this by now with ball player but big xp comes from the program and the games played kind of compiling now no that was not on double xp so if you're in comments wondering if that's on double xp i'm actually making this video right whenever roy holiday ended up dropping so this is normal xp you should be getting roughly about six thousand to four to six thousand xp per game and whenever you end up getting the ball player ones you'll even get up to about ten thousand xp per game which makes it the best xp method in the game because there are times where you'll play like seven minutes of gameplay and you'll end up getting 10,000 XP. It's just, it's absolutely great. It's going to be how I'm grinding and finishing this program and going after my boy Roy Holiday. Now, if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos like this, make sure you guys drop a like and a sub as it helps me out an absolute ton. Thank you guys so much. Have a great rest of your day and peace.